Kent, it's fine. I'll just leave it be. You know what I'm saying? Don't want to mess up somebody else's thing. Noise key. I don't know how to close it, but here we go. We're actually already getting into the match. I can't really mess with these settings like I wanted to. Unfortunately, and Thorn is yelling. So we got Minimade on the Kim. Uh, that was known. I actually didn't know who Archangel played. Thank you, chat, for letting me know the, is the goaded Isabel main. Not just Isabel, goaded. See how goaded this Isabel is? I don't know actually how this matchup goes. Not a matchup that I see very frequently, so it's not like it could be super duper studied up on it. But I do know that Kin is a high damage, high combo conversion monster. And Isabella and Villager are closer to those like mid range style, wanting to keep you controlled characters. And definitely gonna be one of those slogger, slobber knocker like intense sets where you just have to play extremely patient and pick your openings properly, or you might just lose the stock really early to Kin. That was a really good charge smash, wow. Charged up the smash just long enough to call out the jump. Really good anti. Now, they have to make their way back to the stage here. Archangel made it and got some pretty good damage here already at 33. Fighting his way back to center stage. Archangel. Oh, I like that. Trying to catch the two frame, but doesn't get it now. Already on the other side of the stage, Archangel actually has stage position again. And uh, this is not too far of a life lead, but. Unfortunately, one of those situations I was referring to where sometimes you actually just lose to Kin if you get hit by the wrong thing one time. I don't know how to get this thing to stop the open and close threshold. Maybe I should just not have this work. Oh, well. I'd have to check my own personal settings on my laptop, and that's too far. We use my, my stuff for the fighting inside stream, but now we're, of course, all focused on Smash. Doubles is clutched up and over with 3-1, 3-1 for the Ego Boys, and now we have an Ego Boy on screen once again. This is still winnable. I, I fully believe with how Archangel is playing that it's possible, right? Just, if you can avoid enough of... Kin's uh, hit confirms. Oh, and there comes one of the hit confirms. I guess trying to jump out of shield there and move around, hoping that they would not continue that pressure. But Minimate, totally fine with potentially taking the punish there, knowing they have so, so much more stock advantage to work with. Next match, still on a PS2. I think this is a good, this is a good stage. Right? Having the two top platforms to to work with here, like a big enough stage that you can at least get away from Ken and kind of make your movement a little more ambiguous. Oh, that would have broken the shield. Trying to probably let go of shield early to get the parry there, but unfortunately does not get it. Pretty good on the stock positions, not too bad. Both of them relatively even in life here. Oh, calls it out, does not actually get the clean jump over it, so now stuck on the corner here is Archangel. See if Minimate's gonna be able to close it out. He's definitely looking for the Shoryu, but doesn't get it, lands safely, uses the... uses the tilt. Trying to just keep himself in the driver's seat here. That was really good, using the Hado to combo his way back to the stage. Archangel understanding the matchup well enough to know when he can use the items that he's given. And get through. I like that and misses the punish. Archangel able to take center stage here. Once again, still getting juggled. Not one of the best positions to be in as Isabel. I don't think, right? This is one of the floatier characters in the game. Oh my lord. We don't have a over the sofa. I think it may work. Oh, you know where it is? Yeah, it's my center. Oh. Huge. Oh my gosh. Dude, I could have used that this whole time. I could have used that this whole time. Hmm? Ask Mithra if she would have told me? Okay. Yeah. I'll let her know next time that I don't know what the fuck I'm looking for. Uh, I didn't player one, player two. I don't exactly have another team for... A scoreboard? It's fine. Yeah. yeah, I can just do it manually. It's all good. I forgot who's on what side. Archangel is all one word. Okay. I like the winner of this. Oh, shit. I made the top seven Hell yeah.
Rakashi in top 16, let's go. Is Minute Maid all one word? It is! Minute Maid's also all one word, and he is currently a 1 0. And I missed a lot of that uh, of that plastic stain, unfortunately. But we are back into it. We've got everything set up, it looks like. Trying to just immediately call him out with the forward smash there. I like that. Able to, able to maybe get an edge guard here. That's huge. I don't know if he's going to be able to make it back. Saved his jump. Made it back with the Shoryu at the end of that pressure string there. But still getting hit by the up smash out of shield. Archangel evening this out and probably bringing it to a potential game three situation. I wonder if this does make it on to top 16. Oh, oh, trying to use the focus to get through. I like it. Focus to get through once again. Taking a little bit of damage there, but totally fine with that as long as you're not actually getting combo. It doesn't feel too bad. That's a bad position to be in. Oh, so close to getting that. But just been able to close out the round there. I like the, the B reverse. Minute Maid fighting to get back center stage. But Archangel's not giving it to him. Archangel let him have it only to retreat to the edge where you don't have to worry about Kim confirms as hard. Almost got the shield break now. They're going to have to run away just a little bit. Archangel maybe trying to uh, get the reversal of fortune here and push Ken off stage where it's all the tech. Where it's a little harder for Ken to establish any of his big pressure here. I like that, the roll through. And calls it out, gets the up throw, and that is going to take it to a game three. Archangel. Not trying to give away a 2-0 to anyone. Damn. In the game, kick the dog away. All right. you Here we are in the game three to make it in the top 16 winner's side. That's huge. Yeah, really good uh, four tilt there from Archangel. Oh, tried to go for the forward air that would have been able to uh, take off the stock. That would have been a free spike. I'm not sure if that's forward air, if that's down air. I might be making sure. Yeah, Ken, Ken does some damage. Ken is a, is a high damage character. Sometimes you just get hit with a straight confirm at 90% and fucking die to assure you. As you guys Oh, was not able to get the ledge trap there. It's a pretty good position for Ken. Now fought his way back to the stage, able to use the Tatsu to get back to center screen safely. Waited for the roll in, but unfortunately was not fully ready for it even though they waited. Oh my gosh, almost got the kill off of that. Like I said, sometimes you just die to these straight confirms from Ken. Is Jordan still in? Hey Jordan, you still in? Yeah, or it's Jordan said he's still in. Oh my gosh, with the going deep with the with the slingshot, Archangel. Wanting to keep that uh, that lead, but unfortunately losing that stock again immediately. Back to a final stock situation for Archangel. Let's see if they can get something good going to at least take the stock off before they take too much damage. Have to fight their way off of the edge first, and Minimate is not making it easy. Trying to keep this ledge strapping tight. Might even be able to seal it here. Oh, only broke one of the balloons! Minimate knows what they're doing versus these balloons. And that might just be it. Minime puts Archangel into the loser's bracket. No dogs allowed. No dogs allowed. I did it. Only one dog allowed. And that's in you. He's got that dog in him. He's got that dog in him. Bro beat his 